Curtis and Son Funeral Home, the North Chapel on Highway 21 in Sylacauga, and the Childersburg Chapel on Highway 280 in Childersburg, 256-245-4361. For pre-needs, funerals, burials, and cremations, it's Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Sylacauga, Childersburg. Mr. Joseph Joe Murchison, age 83 of Sylacauga, died Tuesday at Goodwater Health Care Center. Curtis and Son Funeral Home will announce the funeral arrangements. Funeral service for Peggy Ann Joyner of Sylacauga is Thursday at 2 p.m. from Estelle Community Church with the Reverends Mark Deason and Nick Lightsey officiating. Burial in the Bluff Spring Cemetery. Visitation will be tonight from 5.30 until 9 o'clock at Curtis and Son North. The body will lie in state at the church on Thursday from 1 until 2 p.m. Online condolences at CourteousAndSonFH.com. Courteous and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel, directing. Funeral service for James Gage Wright, Jr., M.D. of Sylacauga, will be today at 2.30 from First United Methodist Church in Sylacauga. Visitation from 1 until service time, also at the church. Dr. Wright was an active member of the First United Methodist Church in Sylacauga since 1957. He uh, was a physician, uh, staff physician at Craddock Memorial Clinic in Sylacauga from 1957 to 1987, and served as a staff physician at the VA Hospital in Montgomery for some 16 years. He was also a military veteran uh, in the Marine Corps, and he served in the Pacific Theater fighting in the Battle of Iwo Jima, he received a Purple Heart for wounds sustained in battle. Online condolences at CourteousAndSonFH.com, Courteous and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel, directing. Funeral service for Donna Jean Hurst Reynolds, age 72, is Friday at 11 a.m. from Ursary Funeral Home Chapel with Roger Hayes officiating burial in the Oak Hill Cemetery. The family will receive friends Thursday from 5 to 7 o'clock at Ursary Funeral Home in Talladega. Mrs. Reynolds passed away at her residence on March the 12th. Online condolences at ursaryfuneralhome.com, Ursary Funeral Home, Talladega Directing. Graveside service for infant Alec Logan Hooks, age eight months, will be Thursday at 1 p.m. from Union United Methodist Church Cemetery. The Reverend Robert Lee officiating. Family receiving friends at Radney Funeral Home on Thursday from 11 a.m. until noon. Memorial messages may be sent to the family at RadneyFuneralHome.com, Radney Funeral Home Directing. Funeral service for Ms. April Dawn Hunter, age 42, is today at 3 o'clock from the chapel of Radney Funeral Home, Randy Anderson officiating, burial in the Hillview Memorial Park. The family receiving friends today, 1 until 2.30 at the funeral home. Ms. Hunter died March 13th at UAB in Birmingham. She was a member of the Fraser United Methodist Church. The family will accept flowers or memorial contributions can be given to the Lake Martin Humane Society in Alexander City. Memorial messages may be sent to the family at RadneyFuneralHome.com, Radney Funeral Home Directing. Funeral service for Ramey Kyle Sumners, age 41, of Sylacauga, is today at 10 a.m. from the chapel of Radney Smith Funeral Home. Brother Mike Pearson officiating burial in the Evergreen Cemetery. Uh, Mr. Sumners died Sunday, March 12th at his residence. Memorial messages may be sent to the family at RadneySmith.com, Radney Smith Funeral Home, directing. Graveside service for Armin O. Isabel, age 82, of Childersburg, is Thursday at 1.30 from Green Hill Cemetery, Brother Joe Camp officiating, burial in the Green Hill Cemetery of Childersburg. Mr. Isabel died March the 11th in Talladega. Visitation Thursday, noon until 1 p.m. at the funeral home. Memorial messages may be sent to the family at RadneySmith.com, Radney Smith Funeral Home Directing. Memorial service for Mr. Jonathan Glenn Little, age 51, of Alexander City, will be Thursday at 6.30 from the chapel of Radney Funeral Home, Reverend Scott Jordan officiating. The family receiving friends Thursday 5 until 6 at the funeral home. Mr. Little passed away Sunday, March 12th at his residence. He was a member of the Calvary Heights Baptist Church. Memorial messages may be sent to the family at RadneyFuneralHome.com, Radney Funeral Home Directing. And uh, visitation for Gerald Colvin Coach Grogan, 
will be tonight at Kilgore Funeral Home in Pell City from 5 to 7 visitation. Graveside service on Thursday at 3 p.m. from East Abogo Baptist Church Cemetery. The family will receive friends later that evening uh, at Word Alive Church in Oxford from 4.30 until 6 p.m. with a memorial life celebration beginning at 6. Kilgore Funeral Home, Pell City Directing. And funeral service for the Reverend Willie Joe Mallory, age 87, of Alexander City, is today at 11 a.m. from Flint Hill United Methodist Church. The Reverends John Hill, Mike Jackson, Wayne Cowhick, and Dee Dowdy officiating burial in the Hillview Memorial Park. Reverend Mallory died Friday, March 10th at his residence. He served as a United Methodist minister uh, since 1968 and uh, served many churches in the North Alabama Conference of United Methodist Church, most recently at his home church, Flint Hill United Methodist Church. The family will accept flowers or memorial contributions can be made to the building fund of Flint Hill United Methodist Church in Alexander City. Memorial messages may be sent to the family at RadneyFuneralHome.com. Radney Funeral Home, Alexander City, in charge of the arrangements. That's a look at obituaries this morning brought to you by Curtis and Son Funeral Home, the North Chapel on Highway 21 in Sylacaug, and the Childersburg Chapel on Highway 280 in Childersburg, 256-245-4361. For pre-need, funerals, burials, and cremations, it is Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Silicaga, Childersburg.